In terms of uh, what trainee interns would like to know uh, about Auckland District Health Board, I think uh, you've got to look at where you want to be is definitely an important uh, factor in making the decisions of where you want to go. So Auckland is a fantastic city. Um, I've come from Wellington, also a really nice city, but I've been surprised at how many places Auckland have to eat out, um, uh, to go for you know, drinks or meet people. Uh, it's really good, there's lots of young people around and you can get to know your colleagues uh, really well. Uh, Auckland Hospital's got what's said to be probably the best coffee in, the, um, in any of the hospitals in New Zealand, so that's always nice as well. And uh, a lot of the consultants and registrars are more than happy to take you out on, uh, for coffee. In terms of work itself, um, as I mentioned, you've got incredible support, good teaching, um, protected teaching hours. Um, you've got, uh, it's a larger corporation or large organisation, sorry, uh, than some of the other uh, district health boards. And with that comes uh, the positives and the negatives. Uh, so positives would be that there are actually a lot of relief um, people there so there is quite a lot of leave to go around some of the negatives might be that that can be a little bit more convoluted to get than at some other places in which you send a, uh, in Auckland District Health Board you send away um, further leave requests whereas at some places you may be able to just go and talk to one on one with one person but as I mentioned then you have more relievers at a large hospital and it's more common for people to be away, it's less of a big deal on your team and things like that. So uh, swings and roundabouts, uh, it does seem to be um, kind of like it all, all measures out in the end. Show yourself to be keen for the job uh, and show yourself to be uh, compatible with the way that they run things over here. Uh, so yeah, so research and things like that I'd imagine will be quite it's the only one that I know, so uh, it's going to get my recommendation, but I think that it is actually, uh, in terms of what I've heard from my friends, um, very, very good in terms of support and also um, in terms of kind of the general uh, way that it's run here. It is busy. I've heard that it's not, it's not as busy as Middlemore, but it's, uh, I think it's quite busy. And I think the consultants, uh, they definitely set quite a pace. Um, the turnover is quite quick. They get through the patients, you see them, um, you clerk them in, then the next day you go and see them again with the consultant and uh, they help you with things that you could have or would have, should have done. And that's all a learning experience. I think that um, probably that's the best thing that the registrars have kind of empowered the house surgeons to do and, and see as many patients as you possibly can because they believe, and probably rightly so, that that's the only way that you'll learn how to notice things and how to get your clinical acumen up. So in summation, um, Auckland District Health Board is a great choice. Uh, Auckland is a great city to work in. I think that you won't regret coming to work here. Uh, in Auckland City. You'll work hard, um, you'll work for your money, um, but you'll learn heaps and you'll feel at the end of the day a real sense of satisfaction, which I think is probably the biggest thing that's the difference between working and not uh, and being a student or a trainee intern is that you do get a real sense of satisfaction. So good luck with your applications. Um, I'm sure I don't know a single person in my class that uh, is unhappy with where they are. So no matter what you get, I'm sure you will make the best of it. And uh, good luck as house surgeons next year.